So you're still drinking. That's good. I'm glad you're able to, to keep it up. Do you uh, do you work? Do you got you got a job? <laughs> I feel like anytime you talk to somebody about a follow up, you have to follow up and make sure there's everything's okay. Uh, you're doing a half and half. A half and half job. Some people call those part time. <laughs> Unless it's literally at a dairy where you're like processing half and half. I don't know. <laughs> oh, that's actually a fun training. I saw, I was at a, I was at a, this is perfect. I didn't realize how perfect this was going to be. I, uh, <laughs> uh, now I have two milk jokes I can work out. Of. This is great. You give me a choose your own. This is, this is, I haven't seen Bandersnatch, but I think this is how it feels. <laughs> I'm gonna do one of them first. Because one of them might be the closer. I don't know yet. That's the beauty. That's the beauty of this. It's like I don't know. I don't know what to expect with you guys. So I gotta figure out as I'm going along. Like, you know, we already pushed the cum limit, so I can't reel back too far in that direction. Let's see how we feel about this milk joke. Um, I was at the grocery store. Somebody's ready. I was at the grocery store, and I saw a bottle of milk, and on the label it said. Milk so fresh, the cow doesn't even know it's missing. <laughs> That's horrifying. <laughs> I don't want to drink milk from a dairy where they're roofing all the cows. <laughs> okay, so we got it. 